Floss Tube. Hi, Floss Tube. I'm Chris. I'm Jane. And we're the Boss Stitchers. Welcome. Today is March 1st. Happy Meteorological Spring. If I got that word right, <laughs> okay. you know what I mean. <laughs> it doesn't feel like spring everywhere exactly, no, but you no. know. It's, mm. it's a start. Yeah. And this is episode 62, by the way. Yes, it is. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. 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 Thanks for joining us. Yes. For those who um, have been with us before, welcome back. And um, any new subscribers, we hope you will uh, like and subscribe. And um, so... Gee, Chris, what have you been up to? <laughs> well, it's been kind of busy. <laughs> <laughs> My daughter got married this weekend. Yeah. And it was wonderful. Oh, we had a blast. It yeah. was really fun. We really had a blast. Yeah. 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 It was terrific. You'll see a picture of the bride mm -hmm. uh, that yep. Jane will post, and Jane and I mm -hmm. there. Yep. But it was a wonderful yep. time. Yeah, I'll put a couple of pictures in. It was uh, snowing, which the bride was happy about. She wanted to take pictures outside, mm -hmm. and they really came out beautifully. And I got married at the uh, public house in Sterling, Massachusetts. Sturbridge. Sturbridge, yes. right, Sturbridge. Yes, which was um, a, a lovely colonial sort of a uh, Washington slept here kind of place. Yeah. Uh, Built yeah. in 1771. <laughs> uh, yeah, so, yeah, so it was picturesque and it was wonderful to have so many friends and family there. Mm -hmm. And they had a contra dance band which they had promised to us before would be sort of contra dance for dummies. And I'm happy to say <laughs> they didn't lie. <laughs> it was very easy to follow and it was really fun and it got everybody up and Yeah, the yeah. dance floor was packed. It was, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it was packed. Yeah. 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 So uh Oh, and um, you tried a, a new drink, too, right? Oh, they, I did. They had told us about a French 75. Did you try that? Oh, just a sip of yours. Oh, all right. Yeah, yeah it was very good. Mm -hmm. um, I suppose I should have practiced beforehand what was in there. Um, champagne. Champagne. That part I know. Cognac, Twist of lemon. Cognac I think cognac. Or... I think mm -hmm. that's right. Mm -hmm. I don't know if there was gin. Hmm. I said mm -hmm. it was quite good. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. I had so. a um, <clears throat> I had a drink that uh, I uh, I asked the bartender. I said, you know, um, make me a dessert drink. Ooh. So he used um, vanilla vodka, um, okay. Kahlua, amaretto, and uh, white chocolate liqueur. Ooh. And um, shook it all up, and uh, yeah, that, that was, sounds very yummy. Oh, it was really, really yeah. good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I had to go back for another one <laughs> because what I really liked is when he shook. <laughs> <laughs> that was worth it. Huh? He was a very cute guy. <laughs> <laughs> See, a good yeah. time was had by oh, all. Oh, yes, yes, in more ways than one, yes, yeah. So, yeah, it was really wonderful. Yeah, yeah. Happy yeah. to have a son-in-law. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, and um, oh, yeah. I've decided that um, Chris is going to show oh. all of our projects today because show show the folks. Yes, yeah, so she had her her, yes. nail, her nails done for the wedding, and yes. they're still this in tip-top shape. This is probably like a floss tube first for us, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I said to Jane, my only regret was, you know, that we didn't film this um, in the wee hours after the wedding when I... My hair was actually done it, and I had makeup on. So, 
I'm afraid you've missed that. <laughs> well, no, they'll see pictures. They'll see, they'll see, they'll see pictures. pictures. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. So anyway, so oh, actually, I had my hair done. Yes, I just That's what I said. Actually, She's showing me up. Already. I actually just had it done. Yes, and uh, came over to Chris's right after. Yeah. Um, so actually, I'd like to say. Uh, I'm not sure if she's ever going to watch, but I'd like to do a little shout out to Hazel, who is my hairdresser. Um, so uh, she does a wonderful job. And um, the best part is the um, the head massage. Um, I'm so, sold on that. Oh, alone. yeah. 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 Wonderful. Oh, she yeah. works at the uh, Bellagio Salon in Watertown. And um, oh. she's she's very, very good. So right. uh, anyway, I'd have to follow yeah. you over there. You got the, you got the nails. I, I got, got the hair. hair. Yeah, so. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right, we are all, all set. On to stitching. Okay, all okay. Right. That's why we're here. That's right. Uh, <laughs> would you like to throw out the first stitch? Well, yes, I would. Okay. And I think this will go rather quickly. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I did say to Jane, I don't really have a good, good excuse for the past, like three weeks but mm -hmm. um this is my only whip this is my mill hill camping out and this has proven to be a very fun stitch this is i'm doing the mill hill monday sale so i've worked on it on the mondays and um on our boss me boards for February, I also had a Mill Hill five days on that, as well as a five-day freebie. So I did mm. work on this a number of times. You got a lot done. Yeah, it's you coming along. So just the, yeah. basically just the middle of that is? is um, well, and then the be then beading? Kind of, I've kind of, yeah, I still have all the beading to do. We haven't done any of that. And I've kind of gone color by color. So, mm. yeah, it's a little bit more than you write about this one here the with the fire yep. but mm -hmm. i've got you know a few few things on all oh, yeah. of them to yep. to um fix in there i'm glad you bought that me too it is Finally, cute yeah it is very yeah. cute yeah 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 and that's it that's it how about you all right well i've worked on a few things okay. um speaking of mill hill oh, yeah. and mill hill monday uh, this is, um, another, this is a button and beads also from the, um, Christmas Village series. And this is Tree Farm. And, I guess I have a thread hanging, but, um, trying to get it out of the way. Oh, I lost my little, uh, anyway. Um, so this is Tree Farm. And I have started doing, um, I've filled in both of these trees as far as the stitching. I have this one to fill in, and then there's a little bit of stitching over here. But I did start doing um, some of the beading up at the top there. And... Um, you made a lot of progress on that one, Beading too. is going slower than I thought it might. Is it... Yeah, mm. cool. But this is the—I mean, this is really the first um, project that I've—I've I've done beading. Um, oh, and the last time, so remember mm. how we were talking about last year? Yeah. You know, I was talking about last year doing Mill Hill Monday. Yeah. And you said, "Oh, wait a minute! How can this be your first project?" Well, it's because I've been working on it for two years. Oh. So. <laughs> So anyway, so you should have some progress. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You know, I have to anyway. say though, um, we mentioned before when we go to Galleria that uh, Silver Needle has this wall of Mill Hills, and yeah. most of them are done on the fabric. And um, I am having fun doing on the perforated paper, but I yeah. do love the look of the on fabric. That really looks great. Yeah. Um, yeah, they, they make them into pillows. Yeah. Uh, and yeah. It, it is. It's amazing. I, I mean, if you've seen, uh, go back if um, on some of our videos. Um, I'm, I'm sure I've said, I'm sure it's titled something about Galleria. But I always take some um, video of Galleria. So go back. <clears throat> you can see the wall of, yeah. of Mill Hills. It's 
quite impressive. It is. Yeah. yeah. Um, all right. So Good. that is that. And then um, I worked on this little guy. This is um, Arctic Animals number two. And I'm going to do probably, I'll probably do most of these, I think. Is this your small. first finish on this, or have you done any of those, any of that series before? So, no. Okay. No, I haven't. Um, this is on um, 36 count um, Edinburgh linen from Zweigart, and this is the light Excuse ash me. gray and white. <laughs> you all right? I am. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> So that's a, this is a Zweigart fabric. I don't wreck any point. And uh, this, let's see which way it goes. So I started <laughs> doing the puffin. And that's what I have so far. But he looks, it's going to look really cute, I think. Sure. Excuse me. So. I um, love that puffin. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and that will probably be in a smalls exchange. Uh, okay. Down the road. Oh, now we'll all be looking. <laughs> <laughs> uh, then we've had some snow, but unfortunately I haven't really done much on the snow day project. Yeah, I did start it, though, because I finished button up, so I needed a new snow day oh, project. Oh, right, right. And so I decided to do um, Glendon Place. And the Glendon Place is that I'm doing is called... New snow, and there's the there's the picture of it. Oh, it looks like you have some nice fancy floss there. And well, it's so really yeah, good. so it calls for um, what did it call for? Call for like P P R forty, which they don't make anymore. Oh, okay. it's called P R forty. Anyway, they said to substitute the um. Petite Treasure blade, Braid, PB10, which it has, you can see all that sparkle in there. Yeah. Um, Have you worked with that? And no. So, oh. but I, but the, um, the first few stitches, <laughs> it's pathetic. <laughs> uh, but. It's a start. Wait, it's a start, yes. Um, and this is on um, 28 count um, Cashel linen from. Uh, picture of this plus and it's Ooh. called jazz and you can see it's got <clears throat> some blues and purples and well it's blue fabric it's got a yeah. bunch of purple in there um but um this is the this white is going to be the um the snow on the tree <gasps> okay and um it's uh, one strand of white, one strand of treasure braid. Okay. So, and it's not too bad to work with. Yeah. Um, yeah. But it does really give it a nice. Yeah. Yeah. Sparkle. Um, and I don't, I didn't bring the, I don't think I brought the chart, but uh, you know how I was saying that um, they have the um, Karen, is it Karen Wildflowers? Oh yeah. yes, yeah. Um, they don't. They don't have a conversion for that. They have a conversion oh, really? for all of the other colors oh, to DMC, but they okay. don't have a conversion for that. So I'm gonna. I'm definitely gonna substitute those out. So yeah. I just have to yeah. Figure out what I want to use. Um, and then uh, this. This is on my boss me board, um, and I am doing. Um, in this, well, first I have to show this bag oh, yeah. again from our friend Always a favorite. Lillian in Canada. And I love this bag. It's just awesome. Um, and are you going to Stitch North? We hope um, you go on our weekend. Yeah, we're going in April. So um, let us know. Uh, William, if you're going, because we would love to meet you. Yes. Um, anyway, in in my Sylvester Boss Stitchers bag. <laughs> oddly enough. Oddly enough, yeah. which is perfect for this project. 
Um, this is a leisure arts book, uh, Alphabets in Cross Stitch, and it's uh, a Looney Tunes. And inside are um, alphabets of all the Looney Tune characters. So if you can see the back here, here's, here's an example of, of some of them. Um, so I decided um, for any new viewers, um, my last name is Sylvester. And so I decided that I would do my husband's name in Sylvester the Cat. Uh, this is on a uh, 28 count Confederate Gray. And this is what I have so far for his name. So I have, his name's Howie. Uh, so these well, five short letters, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. mine's even better. I know. Yeah. Um, but so the problem is that I decided that, um, that you can do the background, you can fill in the background, any color you want. So I decided on this blue and for some oh. unknown reason, I decided that I would do that one over one. Now I so. remember that. <laughs> I'm feeling really massive. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. So it's a little uh, slow going. Is yeah. That your point? Yep. Yep. Um, and so I just I wasn't sure if I was just going to leave it as Howie or if I was going to then put my name in. And I don't know who talked me into it, but somebody talked me into <laughs> doing both. So right now I am stitching the the little uh, amper stand here. Um, and on my boss me board, I had to, um, um, do put in the, or at least start, um, yes. do the math anyway, <laughs> um, for, oh, for, Jane. for the, and, and, um, and do the Jane, which was supposed to be done by today, which clearly it's not, but we'll be well, done soon. We'll be done yeah. soon. Yeah, yeah. Well, on your I just way. have to do a little math. And Howie's really going to appreciate that you did that one over one. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I know. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. He better. <laughs> um, all right. That's um. That's all my stitching. All right. Uh, finishes. I do have a finish. All right. What did I do with it? I have so much stuff on this table. <laughs> um, so I uh, was in a, a small animal's mood, and so I pulled out this one. Again, this is um, by The Little Stitcher, and this one is Arctic Animals. Well, that's what I meant when I asked you. Yeah. <laughs> I, I was thinking you in another one. So this is like really your first the puffin is like... Oh, I thought you meant... Oh, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah. We're on the same page Oh, now. okay. All right. I thought that you were doing a different one. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, and I have a, I have a lot of these books. I got like the, I don't know, there's a water animals, there's a Arctic animals too, I think. All right. There's a... If there's farm yeah. animals, you've got it. Yeah, well, I don't have the farm. There is farm animals, is but I don't have that yet. Oh, so I'm going to go get that. Stay eventually. tuned, yeah. Anyway, little stitcher. This is the first one that I did. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Sorry about that. And again, this is on the oh. that same linen. And this is, I oh, decided. Do you that for No, I think Ooh. I'm all right. I decided to do the penguin. Yeah. Look at how oh, cute, cute he one. is. I love um, that. They look so good on that yeah. fabric, too. Yeah, it's perfect. And I I didn't have any problems. Some people, I guess, have problems, like, putting the needle through the the, oh. the white because it's, 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 like, painted on. It's oh, it's it? not, you know, it's not okay. really the, the fabric. Um, oh, I see. And then um, I took a, a few liberties with the um, with the snowflakes. Putting them, you know, if in places where the other, like the little dots, were not. So good idea. Yep. Yeah. But I love him. 
It is very cute. But I think he's going to be given away. Another small? Another small, Ooh. I think. Wow, so. you're really making progress on this. <laughs> well, we have a lot of... I know. <laughs> We have a lot of retreats coming up, so I need to... The pressure's on. Yeah. 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 Um, and then I don't have this with me, but I, I did have another finish. I already, So I already gave it away, but I'm going to be getting it back. And the story goes that um, I wanted to stitch this for my friend Janet. And this is a jars design. It's 2008. It's called Friends. Here's the, here's the chart. And it says, a good friend will come and bail you out of jail, but a true friend will be sitting beside you saying, damn, that was fun. <laughs> um, and I stitched this, you can, you, you can see on the, um, on the pattern that it's like a brick or a cement wall. Um, this, oh, uh, this yeah. fabric, uh, was, uh, 25 count hand dyed castle which um, I couldn't find but I did use um, castle wall um, which is a, a, a Zweigart um, fabric um, or maybe it's a fabric flare I can't remember um, I got it at Needleworkers Delight yeah um, but anyway it looks very similar to oh, this and I, and I used um, like a um, a maroon um, floss. Um, but I gave it to my friend. Now, Janet is my friend who is the finisher. And so I gave it to her. <laughs> so, hey, here's your present, but you have to finish it. Uh, <laughs> so I didn't know. Because it will come out so well. That's right. <laughs> so I didn't know um, what she would want to do with it, though. So, um she said she'd like it framed, so I can I will frame it for her, and so I'm going to get this back, and you will eventually see the stitching and the finish um, someday. All right, that's, so, that's um, pretty good. Yeah, so that's it for my finishes. Well, I've got one. Okay. Now I hope people don't think that I'm pulling out. <laughs> the same finish. Because this may look a little familiar <laughs> to previous viewers. But this is the Prairie, Prairie Schooler Santa 1992 that I, of course, have been obsessed with. I just love this. It's my favorite one. <laughs> and I have already made, I made one in January. So now I've made one in February. And as luck would have it in Boss Me, I had five days of Prairie Schooler. Okay. So. So you did if, that? Yep. If Andrea. Are you going to make one in March? Well, I was going to say. <laughs> oh, here we go. Wow. Andrea, a New York needleworker, mm -hmm. she has been very kind, very patient to lend me the chart. And I might try to squeeze one more out. Okay. And I know you're still hoping to do one, too. Yeah, well, as soon as you're done with the chart, I'm going to... Yeah, All right. Yeah, so, yeah. Andrea, you're not going to get that back. <laughs> Maybe we'll but give really it back to you it. when we see you at... Uh, uh, the farm? The farm. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. We might be pushing that a lot. Yeah. <laughs> I just love it, so... That will be number two. Well, pretty soon you're not going to need the chart. You're just yes, gonna be right. Able to it, so. <laughs> Muscle memory will get right. in, right? Yeah. <laughs> now, uh, no FFOs for me. What about you? No. Okay. No. Um, random acts of kindness? Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, we do. Well, um, yeah. I, we have several. I think I'll start off with yours. Okay. <laughs> It was my good fortune that my good friend Jane, <laughs> well, I don't know that you really forgot that you bought this. It was more that... Mm, I couldn't find it. Yeah, you forgot <laughs> where you put it. Okay. So this was from probably 21 Galleria, right? Yes. That you picked this up? Yeah. And, <clears throat> excuse me, it says Meridian Design. It's called In the Air. And in case you can't read it, it says, 
of these two pigs looking at each other. Love is in the air. No, wait, that's bacon. <laughs> and so Jane luckily bought that again this year. Yeah, because I couldn't find it. Yeah, yeah, and as things, you know, inevitably happen, then you find it. Yeah. Um, so I love this. Mm. And uh, it's a cute, small, all DMC. Yeah. Um, I'll be whipping that up in no time. Maybe we should do a bacon sale. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be great, <laughs> Oh, all right. Let's, let's work on that. Maybe post that on. Uh, yeah, I like it. Okay. Yeah, so that's a fun one. So yeah. thank you for that. Um, and I'd also like to thank um, our viewer, Susan, who was a recent winner. And um, thank you very much, Susan, as we always say. Totally unnecessary, but we very much appreciate your kind note and the postage that you sent to us. Thank you. And I also just wanted to tell a view of Barbara. I have been very slow about this, but um, the whale pattern is on its way to you <laughs> as of today. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Excellent. Um, I have one one bit of stitchy uh -huh. kindness that we're going to, well, I don't know if it is, but I'm going to talk <laughs> about it in this segment. So my, um, my mother-in-law um, passed away in um, November. And years ago, uh, mm -hmm. she had given me a um, kit, a cross-stitch kit that was hers um, that she started and then never, um, finished. Um, and it's just a little, it's like a little clutch and you can see that, um, it, it's on, um, a white Ada and then, so you stitch and then you make it, you know, you make it into this little, um, and we know it's vintage purse. by the photo. Yes. By the photo. Really yeah. And, um, and I'll just show you. So this is the font of the, um, mm -hmm. how to, how to do the, um, how to make the clutch. So yes, this is an, uh, this is a very old font Ooh, too. Imagination. Oh, it's, yes. It's, it's, oh yeah. Imaginating. Mm. It's an imaginating kit. Um, hmm. Nope. So old it doesn't have a, <laughs> oh wait, what's that? Oh, wait a minute. Let me get my Roman Nine, numeral 19, calculator out. 1982. Oh, yeah, yeah right? Yeah. Yeah. 1982. And, and we might add that your mother-in-law had how many children? Seven. So she probably was a little busy to do <laughs> much cross-stitch. <laughs> That's true. That's true. For a good portion of her yeah. life, right? So, but this, this is, um, this is the, uh, there we go. Um, so this is the stitching. And um, so you can see that it goes, you know, all across. And you can see how, now, this is not me. You can see how old it is because someone put masking tape Ooh. on the edges. Horror of horrors. Um, so I... I, so she gave this to me and she had started it, um, but um, I finished it. So here's the stitching for the little bag, which I think is really, it's, it's pretty. Yes, it's cute. it is. And um, so here's, here's the whole thing. And the kit came with some, um, just oh, some, backing so some white backing fabric. And uh, so, so I stitched, so my mother-in-law gave this to me. I stitched it. And then for Christmas that year, I gave it back to her, hoping <laughs> that then she would take it, sew it, and give it back to me. <laughs> the gift that kept on giving. That's right. But that didn't quite work out. Um <laughs> But uh, my sister-in-law was, you know, going through her things and she said, oh, here's this box. Um, 
and it's got, um, she goes, I think it's cross stitch. So she goes, um, you know, you might want this. And I'm like, that's the piece I stitched. <laughs> so anyway, I have it back and this will go to my finisher and uh, we'll see what she can do with it. All right. Stay tuned. So, yeah. So this is the stitchy kindness that was from my mother-in-law and then now it's coming back to me yeah. from my mother-in-law. Right. <laughs> so. Ricocheted right back yeah, to you. That's right. <laughs> Well, this, All right. I think next we kind of have, would you say Stitchy Kindness slash haul? Yeah. Yeah. This is a wonderful creation from our friend Tracy at OG Stitchery. And Tracy has recently started to make bags. She's mm -hmm. been making um, zipper pulls and scissors uh, mm -hmm. fobs for, for a while. Yep. And... They are beautiful. She gets very cute beads, makes great combination. And this is her latest work. She has very pretty um, fabrics, different things that I haven't seen mm -hmm. other places. Yeah. And, you know, it was February. That's so right. So you had I to just get had out. to. Yep. Lovely matching interior. Mm. So, I just love this. I'm mm -hmm. dying to put the next project in it. <laughs> <laughs> Which might be Love is in the Air. <laughs> oh, perfect. Yeah. 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 That's right. your haul? Yeah. Okay. That is my haul, I think. Wow. Yeah. All right. Well, I have a few things. Um, I, too, could not resist. <laughs> So that's my bag. So same fabric, a um, little bit of a different uh, different zipper pull. So we can keep them apart. Yeah, and I have a blue uh, blue zipper, but just the <clears throat> if you can see that the X's and O's and hearts in there. It's really cute. Um, and yes, maybe else. I have a couple of um, I think Valentine's ish projects yeah, that I yeah. could, I'm dying to put in there. So, and then um, what started it all was that I saw this <laughs> bag <laughs> that uh, she made. That just and looks like spring, that, doesn't it? Yeah. So it's a good it's March got, first bag. Yeah. All uh, lemons, yeah, and some nice fabric on the back. With um, so lemon fabric. So this is the same as the front, but then look at this fabric. Yeah, that's really cool. Not a great combo. Yeah. So I'll find something to put in there. <laughs> Oh, something tells me you will. And, oh, we, do you have board handy? Yes, yeah, so I do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I got my um, subscriptions to my club, um, Fabric and Floss from Color and Cotton. And this is, uh, let's see, this is called Love Letter. It's a Ooh. 32 count. And... Uh, yeah, I think, I think that's pretty good. Yeah, I yeah. think that's pretty accurate. Yeah. A nice um, basic yeah. light neutral. Yep. Yeah. And I love what she's doing now. Um, she's, she's no longer putting the name of the fabric Ooh. on the bag. But you know, she has these little cards now that she's putting on the... Um, and she's pinning them to the fabric. Good. So that's really nice. Yeah, good plan. Yeah. I used to, I used to like cut out the bag and oh, then put it on okay. there. So, thank yeah. you. That saves me from <laughs> doing that. And then I got my February floss. I love these selections. Yeah. Again. Yeah. So, so very springy. springy. Here nice is 
Here is spring rain. Ooh. It's showing a little darker than it really is. Ooh. And <laughs> I love the names too. This is called duck egg. <laughs> And baby chick. Oh. <laughs> uh, Snapdragon. And toasted marshmallow. And then I get 10 skeins. And we have baby carrots. <laughs> you know anyone that likes those? <laughs> <laughs> this is called Bunny Nose. Oh. <laughs> and Butterfly Bush. Ooh. God, I just love all of these. Yeah, I, do too. I just want to like roll around in them. Or yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> this is called mint chip. Ooh. And I don't even like that flavor ice cream. It still looks good to me. <laughs> and green tea. And this is... That's not showing up that great, but it's got no, some, li it some light pretty. green. And yeah, it's really pretty. Trust us on that. Yeah. Yeah. So that's, that's gorgeous. that. gorgeous. Yeah. Makes you want to go out and get an Easter bonnet, doesn't it? <laughs> With all the frills of <laughs> Beautiful. All right. Thank you. All right. Um, and then um, the Stitcher's Garden was having a, um, a sale. So I just had to mosey on over yeah. there and, and check it out. Um, and I managed to get a few things. Um, this... Um, this came to my house and was oh. um, <laughs> was open by someone. <laughs> so, the, so the package came to my house. That I'm sure they put it on, you know, the front steps. And when I <laughs> that was the first mistake. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, when I came home, it was on the table, and this is what the <laughs> this is what the package looked like. Oh. Uh, Someone just couldn't wait to open it. So I thought, oh man, the post office really, like, what the heck happened? And then realized that, oh no, it's not the post office. It's Chester. the post beagle. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, yeah, so Chester grabbed this off the uh, front steps and went to town on it. Uh, <laughs> luckily, um, he did not get to anything wow. inside. Which is pretty so, amazing because that's pretty shredded. Uh, it is pretty shredded, yeah. yeah. I mean, look at the side and everything. Yeah. So, but, oh, he, it's that funny. guy, I'm telling you. You had something over there and I saw it and I was thinking, oh, that is such beautiful handwriting on that. Oh. <laughs> I didn't notice that the thing was demolished around it. <laughs> Uh, so, um, anyway, I got, um, this, uh, JBW design, the Seaside Alphabet, and, um, it's, Ooh. yeah, so, anyway, I did not spend that amount of money <laughs> on this. That's the good news. So, yeah. <laughs> um, and then I've been, um, thinking a lot about the blue flower, the seasons of the heart mm. and decided that this was the time that I needed For to, a to, to get them. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, she, she did not have, um, summer. Um, she was out of that, but I did get seasons of the heart. So this is spring. Mm -hmm. And autumn and Those are DMC, huh? winter. Ooh, yeah. I just love these. I mean, yeah, I think they are very pretty. Yeah, yeah. And they have all these little elements yeah. in it, the howls and the hedgehogs. Yeah. And, um. So I just think they're really cute, and um, 
I eventually will find Summer and get that. Yeah. And um, as Chris always says, you know how much I love a good series. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> and these are small. I was surprised that they're as small as they are. They're 101 by 80. Oh, yeah. I think they're all 101 by, yeah. They're all oh, 101 right. by 80. So that's a small. It is. Yeah. I can yeah, whip these up in no time. Yeah, I think really. you're gonna get something for everything we're going to this yeah. year. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> um, so yeah, so that's my haul. Um, let's talk about plans. Well, we as, as Jane and I were, <laughs> we had um, some big plans, but yeah. uh, you know, we just don't know what three, they are what, yet. Three weeks went by. <laughs> I <and> know. <laughs> And here we are. <laughs> and uh, the, our boss me number is our version of WIPCO mm -hmm. uh, that we do with, um, well, several friends now. But yep. Kathy of Two Needles Pulling Thread mm -hmm. pulls the numbers for us. Mm -hmm. And I know I was as anxious as everyone else to have them pulled and see what they are. Mm -hmm. And she pulled them. And I wrote it down. And I have not yet gotten to the computer and checked those. <laughs> So I'm not sure what my plans are in that regard. Um, uh, how about you? Well, likewise, um, I uh, I don't know what I know what the numbers are, but I don't know what my projects are. Yeah, yeah. Um, because today is just March first. That's true. You know, that's true. Although I yeah. do have to finish my February. Um, I I have to finish the um, like at least start the name. My name. Oh, right. For okay. that Sylvester right. alphabet. I, I did meet my February goals, mm. my Bosby goal. Yeah. Um, however, I am still short one goal on January. I was going to use my extra time to mm -hmm. um, get back to um, Last Ditch Cemetery. Oh, yeah. And like <laughs> that uh, Last Ditch Cemetery has proven so correct for me. <laughs> 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 All the things that they state, like lost interest, uh, yeah. <laughs> too old, like everything is just fit for me. It's fun. So I didn't get that one, but yeah. And I am anxious to see what March has and forge ahead. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Um, so my other plans are um, I want to stitch some more smalls. Um, yeah. And yeah, get ready, start getting ready for retreats. Yeah. Our first one is coming up at the end of April, yeah. which is. That's, yeah, that's it's gonna how be. Yeah. Long. Um, right. I've, I've right. seen more um, postings about that on the Facebook group and mm -hmm. people commenting and getting excited about that and asking about sm smalls and everything. Oh, and they posted the vendors this week. Did you see that? Oh, no, I didn't. Yeah. yeah. Oh, good. Yeah, a lot of different, um, I mean, of course, one folk embroidery will have something special there, mm -hmm. but um, a lot of names I wasn't familiar with. So. Oh, that's great. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that'll be good. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, so it's a, what, like an eight hour drive for us? Yeah, which that isn't so, bad. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Um, anyway, uh, let's see, what other plans did I have? Um, any, um, market plans per se? Not really. No, mm. I'm trying to behave. Me too. Until... Yeah. I mean, I've got a list. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah, well, you know. <laughs> Well, there's nothing wrong with a right, wish right. list. Right, but I haven't pulled the trigger. Yeah, on there's nothing wrong yeah. with a wish list. Yeah, uh, yeah there, were, there were a couple of things that I've seen that, um, yeah, I might not be able oh, to yeah. live without. Yeah. But, um, <laughs> I also put in an order for um, um, stitches and things. Um, oh. They, unfortunately, are going to be going out of business. Um, so, if if there's anything that interests you in that shop, um, head on over there and get it. Uh, there is a um, a sale going on mm. um, to clear clear inventory. So uh, I did purchase a few things. Um, probably show that in our next mm. video. Um, 
But I am trying to save money. Yeah, yeah. So I'm uh, really looking forward to Stitch North and all the other events to follow there. But yeah, yeah. I was telling um, I was going through like because usually you know it's the weekend, so right. depending on where it is and how long it takes us to get there, I'll either take Thursday and Friday off of work or just Friday. Right. Um, and I was sort of counting and going through the dates. And um, and, and I always <laughs> said, oh, it looks like we're not taking a vacation this year. <laughs> yeah, so, we, we're kind of making a big dent in the retreat calendar yeah, this year. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, all right. Well, I guess um, that's it. That's then. it for now. Then. Okay. All right. So we will um, be back to our regular yes. every other week schedule. Yes. 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 Yeah. Your, your daughter really screwed up our. Uh, yeah, our, our, I know. Our, I don't know. I should <laughs> take that into consideration. <laughs> you know what? I was just thinking. Of what I was going to mention. Um, um, ironically, at the public house, I believe that there was the Stitches Hideaway. Oh, retreat, oh, right? Mm, that mm. led like right up to as we were checking in uh -huh. um, for the wedding. And I did not get a chance to go over there, but um, somebody said to me, Oh, I think there were cross stitches here. <laughs> 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 so I hope you all had a wonderful time. There. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. So um, until next time, uh, be well, and uh, we'll see you in a couple of weeks. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.